Hello, Dr. Mormon, John Medina here. Um, I'm just recording this before I head off to my restaurant experience to say that I'm going to be going to Doi Grill. Um, Doi Grill is a Mediterranean food kind of restaurant. And um, this is just like a little history on the restaurant that I did um, before I actually wanted to go eat it. Um, this is an article off the Fresno Bee on my phone. It says, the owner of Doi Grill on Herndon Avenue learned about food from his Turkish grandmother. His recipes are some of the exact and adapted made to inspire the restaurant's Mediterranean cuisine. Um, a quote from the actual restaurant owner, his name is um, Nivzet Ozner. I think that's how you pronounce it. But he says, no is not our thing. We are here to please and we go out of our way to make sure that the people are happy with their food. And um, so it seems like it's going to be a really friendly environment. I'm looking forward to it. You know, um, in our book and Lustig and Coyster, I believe it's in chapter two. It's when they talk about how um, communication is an interactive tool and during intercultural conversations, it's going to require description, interpretation and evaluation. So those are three things that I'm really looking to focus on when I go and uh, I actually uh, eat a meal there or have conversations with some of the people there. Those are things that I want to look for and try to um, comprehend as an interactive tool. So um, I'll check back when I'm done eating. Okay, so I'm back from my restaurant, um, Doi Grill. When I went, it was uh, really cool. I walked in and they had, you know, um, really... Uh, HD pictures of like fresh produce and stuff kind of just to add to the aesthetics of the restaurant but um, They were playing like Middle Eastern music there or Mediterranean music and I thought that was something that was pretty cool I went with my grandmother and she was talking about how when she goes to like, you know Mexican restaurants in town they play hip-hop music and she think that that takes away from like the um, authenticity or just like takes away from the cultural experience so like I feel like the music that they had playing was like really just a cherry on top. Um, I ordered uh, just chicken kebabs. Uh, they put it on pilaf with these like really round beans and um, it came with like some salad and balsamic and then baklava and tzatziki. Um, it was a mountain of food. I actually took a picture. So there you can um, see the salad, the pita bread, it was all made really fresh and that white sauce oh there's me eating the chicken um the white sauce was actually called tzatziki and i wasn't really sure what that was so i asked our server i said you know what is that sauce and she said well it's kind of like sour cream but it's more of like a cucumber base spread and it was so good it was like unbelievably good and then um the baklava at the end was just kind of like the little cherry the dessert you know and when I was over in Greece, how I talked about with my people to people, I actually went to a baklava uh, plant and saw how, you know, real authentic baklava was made from hand. And um, this baklava tasted pretty good. Um, I don't think it was as good as the one in Greece, but it was pretty close. It definitely wasn't bad by any means. But um, it was really a culturally a cool experience to just go and um, talk to someone I talked to her a lot about the chicken and stuff and they had chicken and beef and it was all just kind of Turkish based meals. And I had never really had, you know, uh, recipes based on uh, Turkish. I've had Mediterranean food before, but I guess there's some subtle differences that she was telling me about and um, kind of how uh, Lustig and Koyster talk about, I think on, I think it's page 209 about how, you know, um, intercultural communication should like add some stress to people. Like, you don't always know what you're going to get when you go to these restaurants. And it's just cool that, um, you know, uh, over at Doi Grill, they're able to uh, add to that assurance factor of the meal.